Welcome back. If you just joined us, you may want to later on check in on CBSBoston.com and see what you missed as we're talking about the Democratic presidential race with body language expert and analyst Don Corey. Okay, Don, in the first of the two debates, really the biggest name there was yes. Senator Elizabeth Warren. Sure. And she had what I thought was an easy night. Okay. No one really went after her. She was kind of the star of the show early on and then faded into the background. Right. And let's take a look at what we're seeing from Elizabeth sure. Warren. And you've been critical of her TV body language in the past. Why? Right. Well, I mean, you know, she's very jerky. Her This head movement that she has is very off-putting. The side to side. The side to side. Yeah. Again, you know, her base will love it, but the independent voters will not. Explain that, because uh, the base, a, a Warren supporter would say, well, she's passionate. Right, she's passionate. But the, the independent voters want the very even-keeled vocal pitch and tone, very even-keeled in their, in their nonverbal behavior, their body language, and she doesn't have that. Mm. Okay, so, and every time you see her hands come up, right. you think it, it, it's okay for Bernie, but not for her? Well, when Bernie comes up, it's still slow and methodical. Um, when she does, it's very much a jerky movement. But with him, there is no lie. And so, I don't mean by lie, I'm not saying she's lying. Right. I'm just saying he, his authenticity is... It's is, so well established. It's so well established. Is, it a, is, there a, is there a gender thing here, too, where I don't women are supposed to be more restrained? I, I don't think so, and I don't think Hillary Clinton lost because she was a woman. I think she lost because she was a, a bad candidate. Yeah. I think Amy Klobuchar, should she get the nomination, um, will destroy... Uh, President Trump in a general. Well, that's an interesting comment. Yeah. Well, let, maybe we'll have time to return to that, but I okay. do want to slip in two more clips sure. from this debate, by the way, courtesy of MSNBC. Um, Beto O'Rourke, the Texas congressman, under fire first from New York Mayor Bill de Blasio. Right. He's having a hard time. You know, again, he's in these jerky movements. He's really trying to defend himself. And de Blasio, if you look at his facial expressions, uh, he's very much, you know, he's got this, this quick smile, this duping delight, like he's somehow getting one over on him. And, and it's, it comes across as, uh, as very unauthentic. And, and then uh, Maryland, former Maryland Congressman John Delaney jumped in after right. their spat. You thought he did I, well. I thought he did uh, amazing. But, you know, he, he, he's just never going to get the traction because he doesn't have the profile. No one knows who he no is. No one knows yeah. who he is. All right, now let's look at the final clip here. This is uh, Julian Castro. Right. Uh, uh, the uh, of Texas going after O'Rourke on, I believe it was health care reform. Right. So what are you seeing? Well, I mean, O'Rourke is still the same trying to defend himself uh, and being aggressive and not feeling comfortable. But the difference between Castro and de Blasio is Castro is very even keeled, uh, deliberate, slow and methodical. And you're seeing the head, the, the bowing of the, the head. The bowing of the head. That's an, an anxiety. Right, an anxiety really trying to get into, uh, you know, uh, into the conversation and get his point across, which he's having a hard time He's doing. struggling. He's struggling. He also yeah. licked his lips a couple of times. He licked his lips a few times. That's never good. That's never good. Yeah. You know, and then Castro, again, is very even keeled. Um, in the few remaining seconds we yeah. have here, you mentioned Klobuchar. Right. What do you see uh, so effective about her body? Well, again, she's that even keeled. She's okay. very uh, methodical, calm. even keeled, calm. Yeah. And I think that in a town, if you, if you compare her with the president in a town hall debate, she kills it. Wow. Yeah, more so than any of the other candidates. Well, we got many more debates to come, yeah. and in a couple months' time, Don, you got to come back and update us on what you see. Okay, hey, thanks, John. Appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. Thank you. No, no, <laughs> cut it out. That's uh, body language expert Don Corey. That's it for me. Now it's right back over to my colleagues for more WBZ News.